hello guys welcome back to another youtube video where today i'll be showing you how to play games in windowed full screen just a quick disclaimer i have tested this with some games that it works with and there might be some games that are not supported with this program that we are going to use before we get started here is an example of what to expect when using window full screen mode usually when you tab out of games it will minimize the whole window of your game with this program installed, it allows you to tab out and it will not minimize your game. For example, I tab out, I go to a notepad, that's open, I can type whatever I want, I do test, I can tab back into my game and it'll play. So this program is called DXWind, which stands for Direct Draw Windows. You can either click the link in the description to download this program or you can search it via Google. So when on this page, you'll be redirected to sourceforge.net. Go ahead and click download right here. And it will say your download will start shortly. Just wait for that. As you can see, I've already downloaded this. I will go through the installation process again. So with this downloaded, you can double click on what you've just downloaded. We are going to put this to a side. And now what we need to do is open up File Explorer. And what you are going to do is you can go to any directory that you want. It can be in document. It can be on your desktop downloads, literally anywhere. Just make a new folder and we are just going to call this DX, whatever you can call it, whatever this is where we're going to put the files into. So in the win row, we are going to copy all by pressing control and a, and we are going to drag all this to the new folder that we made. With that done, you can X out of WinRAR as we don't need it anymore. And now with all the files that are in the folder, what we are going to do is double click on the application, the X wind, double click that. When you open it for the first time, you will see attention. Don't worry about it. Just ignore it. Press OK. And now with this open, this is what it will look like. Obviously, I have an icon right here. I will show you how to set that up. So in order to set up our game to have windowed full screen, what we need to do is right click anywhere in this window and press add. A new window will pop up. What you want to do is go to the path of your game and then you want to select the application. If you are using uh, Steam, you can go to your Steam, uh, go to any game, you want to right click it, press manage browse local files as this will take you to the directory of where your game is installed for me it's this one assassin's creed 2 game and it says application so now we know where our game is i am going to copy this directory by pressing ctrl c i will close this window we don't need it anymore and then i will paste it here and where it says assassin's creed 2 game i'm going to click that and press open as you can see text is now in path and where it says launch you want to press the three dots and you want to do the same file again so again press it has to free to game in my case and then click open but for the name you can put whatever you want it does not have to match your game i could just put ac2 and then press ok and as you can see the game is now here so before we launch our game, what we need to do is press right click and then press modify. So when you modify this, it needs to have the following. If you want, you can copy and paste all this information uh, into your program. Uh, this is very important. Uh, at the bottom, it says window initial position and size. I have mine at 1920 by 1080. This is so it matches my monitor. So other settings, video, mouse, DirectX, DirectX 2, Direct 3D, libs, and notes. You can pause at any point to copy all these settings. Then once you're done, press OK. Then once you have that all set up, you can go ahead and either double click on the game that you created, or you can right click it and press run. So as you can see, the game is now running and you can tab out at any point. 
it is now in windowed full screen if you found this video very informative or it helped you please leave a like subscribe actually no just grab the subscribe part if you have any problems with setting up the application or anything like that uh, leave a comment down below and i will try to help so thank you for watching and i'll see you guys over the next video peace